The handling of the COVID-19 pandemic, its economic aftermath, recently became the main topic of discussion at the 37th ASEAN Summit. During the last day of the 37th ASEAN Summit on November 15, President Joko Widodo attended a number of virtual conferences from the safety of the Bogor Presidential Palace in West Java. The president started by attending the 11th ASEAN UN Summit, followed by attending the 4th Summit for the Regional Comprehensive Economic Partnership, or RCEP. During the 37th ASEAN Summit, President Joko Widodo, alongside leaders from member countries, set up a joint plan to prevent the COVID-19 pandemic from having a wider negative health impact in the region. They also discussed about prioritizing economic development in partner countries, as well as necessary measures to mitigate the economic and social impacts of the COVID-19 pandemic. The president also attended the 23rd ASEAN Plus 3, or APT Summit. During the summit, Indonesia Foreign Affairs Minister Retno Marsudi conveyed President Joko Widodo's message, which advises APT member countries to have health resilience mechanism. Such mechanism might include adequate health infrastructures in a national level. Berkata dari pandemi saat ini, Presiden menyampaikan bahwa ASEAN Plus 3 APT perlu memiliki mekanisme ketahanan kesehatan kawasan untuk menghadapi pandemi di masa mendatang. Kita harus keluar dari pandemi ini sebagai pemenang. The president also deemed necessary the construction of an ASEAN center for public health emergencies and emerging disease. He further added that Indonesia is prepared to host such a facility.